Patrice Bergeron, Shane Willis, Mike Maniscalco, our Valley Sports crew, bringing you the game. Abby Labar on the sideline. Shane, game seven. Here we go. Charging after it was yes for Foss, but Boston will clear. In the neutral zone is Brad Marchand. He'll put a shot on Rotha Handles, and a sharp angle chance off the side of the net. It's tied up by Pesci. They got something going on behind the play, but the game's moving forward. Marchand then swings his stick, takes it out of Pesci's hand, and a shot put on by Brady. A young player growing up has dreamed about scoring an overtime winner, especially in Game 7, as Scotty Walker did that night. Smith gets a shot deflected right on, rebound out in front. Lawrence can't get to it, and the Bruins will clear. He'll get it to D'Angelo. Svechnikov takes a hit at the side of the net, and Ajo keeps it alive, and he'll get it to Svechnikov. Out front for Jarvis, and his shot, Swayman gets the glove to it. Crowd gets into it, Mike. Seth Jarvis in front, he has to first take it on his backhand, turns and fires. New center ice, Tara Vinen. He'll pull and shoot, Swayman makes a shoulder save. Now rebound out in front, Domi gets a heavy shoulder, puck still loose out in front. Kane's trying to track it down. Tara Vinen giving a hit along the boards, they'll let the boys play. Charlie Coyle throws this back into the Carolina zone. Frederick slaps a shot right out. He's giving a big hit, and then a huge hit delivered on the side, and a penalty coming up. Now Stall and Tara Vinen head to the bench. Boston, we get a look at Taylor Hall. He puts a shot at him. Ronta has the glove ready, and he'll hang on. He just tries to get it back to the point. Interrupted, though, by Posternock. Both players come out of the box. Posternock takes it away. His shot rolls in. Ronta can't see it. Still losing that. Ronta will finally cover it up. Auntie Ronta. No score between the Hurricanes and Bruins. Thanks to Auntie Ronta reading the play. It just elevates you to another level, whether it be a game seven or a game one in any series. We've been in a lot of building shape. He a player as this shot put on, and Ronta makes the save. It does not get louder than PNC Arena. Uh, it's big as well because Forbert will be off of the ice, a big penalty killer. He's got nine blocks in game three, and the Canes play bumper. Trocek shot right on. Derek Forbert. He'll give it away in the neutral zone, but Shea can't handle it. Poster knock. No leave it forward. Now send it across. Buzz it in. Ronta! Oh, mercy! What a save! But it was all about Auntie Ronta right before this, Mike. Post to post with a huge pad save on Taylor Hall. And a trip for Clifton. Now the shot from the boards, and Ronta will catch that and hang on. Stall for the Canes and Tara Vinen. A spinning drive there. It's put on by Lindholm. Save made. and It's game seven. He's not a rookie anymore. The head coach is throwing him out four on four hockey shape. Well, he had a unreal game five here, Mike. Shea through the neutral zone for Carolina to Svechnikov. Svechnikov powers his way. He'll get a shot through and Swayman has to make the save as Shea provided some net front. Trying to clear Bergeron, knocks it down. Now Marchand trying to get a shot. Pesci makes life difficult. Thrown out in front, rebound, and Ronta has to be ready. Physical play by the Kane centerman. Now Hall gives it away again to Ajo. Ajo, does he have a lane to shoot? He does, puts it right on, and Swayman makes the save and will hang on. The Kane's throw check. Trying to circle behind the net. Top Slavin, skate to stick, the feather one side of the net, up front, they score! Tavo Teravainen! And they're off and running, Mike, because of a great breakout in their own zone with Tony D'Angelo and Max Domi. Max Domi works extremely hard away from the puck to be an outlet for D'Angelo. Gets up the ice, a great pass down low, and then what a feed to finish it off. Domi to Teravainen, one nothing Hurricanes! Carlo trying to clear, Tara Vine knocks it down and gets it to Ajo. Five seconds left in the period. D'Angelo tries to get a shot to Jarvis right up. Rebound out in front, Swayman with his best save of the first period to keep it a 1-0 Hurricanes lead after 20. Opportunity to end this period here as it gets to the outside. There's a shot, a rebound in front, Trocek just hacks it. Just past the right pad of Jeremy Swayman, he gets a piece of it. Four for 18 at home. They are five for 34 in the series. And the second period's underway. 
Back to D'Angelo. 220 left in this power play. Shot hits the post. Trocek rings the post to the left of Swayman. Blocking ability of Forbert in the first period. Mike, he continues to do it here in the second. Wearing number 28, very similar to Ian Cole with the amount of shots that these guys eat around their goaltender, helping them out. Domi puts one in the score! the quick hand on Max Domi to come from below the goal line out in front of the goal line and stick it in the net with his backhand. This one away from Bergeron and then Stahl knocks it out to center ice. McAvoy avoids a hit. He'll get it to Bergeron. He'll spin try to start up in front. Are they going to say it's a goal? Yes, they do score. DeBrusk waited for the signal from the official. And Bergeron finds DeBrusk out front and the Bruins Chop the Canes lead in half. It's a 2-1 game. Out into the neutral zone. They quickly turn it back. Red Pesci steps up, taking away time and space, but it's just a quick pass in front. And Brady Shea just can't tie up DeBrus stick in time. He gets enough of it. It goes off Auntie Ranta's pad and into the right side corner, bringing the Bruins within one. Taking a hit from Charlie Coyle along the boards was Domi. Max Domi has been everywhere here in this hockey game, Shane. He's had some quickness in his step today. Fred Frederick shot. That rings the post. Ronta might have gotten a piece. And his left post got the rest of it. Show check. We'll let it go set up for Domi. He scores! The building is on fire. So is the Trojic line. It starts in the defensive zone. Trent Frederick hits the post, and then the Canes come all the way back down the ice. It's a pass from Tavo Teravainen on the money for Max Domi to one time it to the back of the net. This guy is on fire. The building has erupted. 3 1 Hurricanes, Mike. 20 minutes to go. You're in the lead. Break it down. Is it shift by shift? Is it minute by minute? And McAvoy throws this one into Frederick. Rebound to Hall. Arata with the save. Puck still loose in front of the blue paint. Around the boards, Marchand to McAvoy. To Hall. Hall back across. Marchand shot right on Rata with the save. Slavin. Long pass. Pesci will track it down. Games can't clear. Shea stick explodes. It went to the bench and Bob Gorman hands him a stick. Rebound to the side. Boston will score. Poster knock. As Carolina couldn't get the puck out of the zone. The first play, it breaks his stick. As the puck comes out, his stick explodes in his hand. He makes a decision to try and get to the bench and back to make a defensive play. And the Bruins get a second lucky bounce as it ricochets off a Canes player directly onto the tape of Pasternak. This was not a direct pass. This was a shot that ricocheted off Pesci straight into Pasternak's wheelhouse. No chance for Antti Ranta. Boston sent to the front. Ronta gets a pat to it. Still loose at the side of the net. Kane's trying to clear. Bergeron has it. He feathers one. Ronta kicks it out. Four seconds left. Three seconds. One second. The Kings are going to the second round of the Eastern Conference playoffs.